Hey, this is Joel Wilmoth, and we've got another video for you today regarding who are the HUD asset managers. This is a question we get asked a lot because it's a little bit different concept than what HUD had done in the past, but we're going to spend a few minutes today talking about who these asset managers are. First thing you want to know is that there are three asset managers in each of the two regions where we work, which are regions 1A and 2A. 1A is Indiana area, Midwest. 2A is Southeast in Florida. So each of the, those three those states have asset managers, there's three asset managers. And uh, the asset manager concept was set up so that HUD, after they take back a property um, through the foreclosure process, they will work with a field services company, which we call an FSM, or an AND, an asset manager, who um, is responsible for the marketing and management of the property. Asset managers then select a local listing broker to handle properties to actually do the marketing management in local markets. And that's what Wilmoth Group is, as we are a local listing or a neighborhood listing. Region 1A and Region 2A both have three asset managers and they happen to be the same companies. Pemco, Afori, and Home Telos. And what we want to do today is take just a second to show you their websites and get, show you real quickly how you can get into their site, find the forms you need, get your questions answered, and proceed to successfully sell a HUD home. Here is the site for PEMCO. It's called HUDPEMCO.com. The site offers a number of different uh, bits of information for agents and buyers. There's, there's an event calendar regarding trainings and other outreach events, and then there's a column with regard to HUD uh, news and events. The um, section that most brokers want to know right away is how to get to forms. It's right up here at the top in the header. See forms. Go to section 1A and 2A. It'll take you to a list of forms that includes You'll hear us talk a lot about autofill contracts. It's the easy way to do a HUD contract and get all the forms right and get all the information put into the right spot. It's like filling out a questionnaire. You'll find that here at HUD Penco. You'll find it at all three of the asset manager sites. You'll also find other forms that you may need as you proceed through the closing process. Sometimes buyers need to add a, a purchaser or they need to change their uh, financing. That is here. Also, if you need to make a request for an extension or unfortunately something happens and you've got a contract cancellation, all the forms are right here for you to use uh, and also contact information for the FSMs, the field service people. So PEMCO has this all right here in this section under this header called forms and that's where you want to be able to get to quickly at HUDPEMCO.com. The next site we'll visit is AforiREO.com. Their site also offers different types of HUD news and frequently asked questions. The form section is here under brokers. You'll see procedures and other types of links, but the one you're looking for is forms. Here you'll find a fillable HUD sales contract and um, other forms like certification of owner occupant, your HUD sales contract cancellation, which we hope you never have to use. Uh, adding, removing purchasers, changing financing. It's all right here. Aforiario.com has a great selection of sites, of, of forms, and other types of information that you can use to successfully sell your HUD home. Home Telos First is the site for Home Telos, obviously. It is a site that's got some great features for um, home buyers in particular. And if you want to get to the forms, you go right up here to the top where it says Real Estate Professionals. Click on that and you can find three areas right here. Most of you will be working with General, but if you have a good neighbor next door, that's GNND. You click on this, it expands. You'll find a um, sales contract, autofill form. You'll find all these same forms that you may need. Contract release and earnest money disposition. Again, you hope you never have to use that. Uh, selling broker commission addendum which is a unique form for home telos and let me just stress each of these asset managers have their own forms so don't try to intermix if you're working with home telos use home telos forms go to their site use only home telos site forms any asset manager same rule only use their forms go to their website 
get their forms. At Wilmoth Group, we want you to be successful selling HUD homes. That's what we're here for, is to answer your questions and provide you as much information as we possibly can to make this process easy and make it something you want to do over and over again. We have a resources of information available to you. If you look over here to your left, you can find contact information. Our website, I suggest you take a look at that. We've got a lot of information there. But also take a look at hudhomestore.com and look at in the tab section under the frequently asked questions and you'll get a lot of questions answered there too. Again, thank you for watching this video. Have a great day and look for us again on another helpful HUD